Hey, it's Offrock here. Let's play GeoGuessr. It is Tuesday, so it's time for the GeoGuessr subreddit challenge. Of course, you can find that over at reddit.com slash r slash GeoGuessr. If you're watching live on Twitch, and you should be, don't get confused. It's still Monday as I record this. Yes, I'm recording on a Monday, but typically I record on a Sunday. Check the schedule or the Discord for more details. Uh, we're going to do the U.S. Capitals challenge again. This is U.S. Capitals number two, and this time I'm not going to move because it turns out we weren't supposed to last time. Uh, oops. So here we are in the capital city of Kansas. We can scroll. It's just a level three challenge. Outside of Huntoon Park. The capital city of Kansas, if I do recall, is Lawrence. Um, but we will we will go check that out to see if that's the case. Uh, Huntoon Park. Ah, here we go. At Huntoon Street. Fair enough. So let's see if Lawrence is indeed the place. If not, I will have to recalibrate what I believe is the capital of Kansas. Oh, it's Topeka, actually. Now that I see that. Derp. How are you doing? Um, I don't think it was Lawrence. What is there in Lawrence? Let's zoom over to Lawrence here for a second. It is Topeka. I just want to see what is in Lawrence that it made me think that was the capital of Kansas. Of Kansas. Nothing really. It says University Place. So what university is here? Oh, University of Kansas. Maybe that was it. No, it's Topeka, Kansas. Uh, Topeka, 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 Topeka. Is there a timelet? There is. Okay. We just have to find Huntoon Park. Um. Just wanted to see anything about that, uh, board versus brown thing. Brown versus board, rather. Huntoon Park, Huntoon Park. What else we got around here? Blue Cross Blue Shield thing, Capital Federal Savings. It's the BCBS of Kansas. Anything up there? No. Huntoon Park. Well, that's a shame. Well, Huntoon runs east-west. Whatever street I'm on runs north-south. I wish there was a street sign for. Oh, it looks like it's on the other side of that, and because it's a one-way street, we don't get it. It's a very insidious location. Very sneaky. Huntoon Park. I'd love for this to be like the, um... Oh, I don't know, like, uh... Well, first off, let's get points. Um... Like a sign, you know, it says, like, Capital City sign. Like, the, like the Topeka Water Tower. You know what I'm saying? A lot of parks in Topeka. I approve of that in principle, but it's kind of annoying as hell when I'm trying to find this particular park. And this is where I'm going to find out it's actually Lawrence and not Topeka, and I've just, like, did a double blind against myself, because I would do that. I'm going to assume that it's not green, right? Because this looks like we're, well, it doesn't look like downtown. Oh, oh my god. It is Topeka Road, perf. There's Southwest Topeka Boulevard, but is that Topeka Road? Oh, no, maybe it is Boulevard. Oh, it is Boulevard. Beauty, 42 seconds left. Give me Huntoon. Huntoon Park, boom. That'll be close enough. 5,000. Ooh, God, we're chasing bread. Yikes. Yikes. Imagine a 5,000 floating up the screen right now. Not in front of me. It'd be, like, it'd be like over here. No, it'd be over here. I'm going to work on that. Nighty suggested that every time someone posts a 5,000 emote in chat, it should appear in the video. And I, and I agree. I don't know how to do that yet. I put the call out to Light. Light is very smart about these sorts of things. He, he may know. Montgomery Dialysis on Forest Avenue. Forest and Beauregard. So that's perfect, at least. So if we, if we figure out what town we're in, we should be able to relatively easily get our information here. The license plate looks like it's a rainbow license plate. That's confusing. So 
This one's gonna be a little trickier. Oak Park. Part of the Montgomery Parks and Rec. Montgomery, Montgomery, Montgomery. I saw the city name. Was it Montgomery Parks and Rec? Oh, Montgomery Dialysis. Derp. That's in um, Montgomery, Alabama, right? Yeah. Do, do, do. Forest and Ivory. No, Forest and Beauregard. Forest runs north south. Uh, do we know anything about this forest? No, I can't see anything about Beauregard. I do know the address is 1001, though. Hmm. First off, we'll get some points. Forest. Is that for uh, General John J. Beauregard? Because if it is, then kind of like, I love this. It's like, well, we really should probably honor Lincoln, but let's toss him a tiny little street by the uh, cemetery. The problem is Beauregard is so small. But I was going to say, like, if I, for instance, Jefferson Davis Avenue, if I found, like, avenues of other soldiers, finding Beauregard might be more possible. Rosa Parks, at least, her street's sort of long. I could probably try and look for the dialysis center, but that seems risky. Oh, Oak Park! Derp, derp, derp. We're next to a park. Oak Park. Oak Park. Oak, Oak Park. Ha-ha! Forest and Beauregard. Blammo! Five thousand. And if round three is getting Sagittarius, I'm not liking my chances. Is it because of the rhythm? Is the rhythm is gonna get ya? Booty, boop, booty. Ole ole, ole oa. All others will be towed. Georgia statute 13 OC. Looks a little flat to be Georgia. What else would be G though? Florida, Georgia, Hawaii. Nothing. It's a city you've been to even. Didn't help. That's all I've got to go with right now. So I'm going to think this is in Atlanta for the moment. Employee parking. Employee of what? Appropriate music. Yes, trying to find, trying to hunt where I am. Looks like Lance, maybe. Georgia is a rear state. Meaning the plates. I can see the rear of a car. There's one. Boy, that's so far away. It could be the, the peach design, though, because it's black letters with the peach in the middle. But, man. that's This is real thin on the ground, I will admit. It looks like North or West Lance, maybe, or Land. And we know we're next to a parking lot for employees of something. Boy, this is foolish to just base it off the G. But, like, ORC is the Ohio Revised Code. MCC is the Michigan Code of Conduct? Why is it MCC now that I think about it? Criminal code, maybe? The only state in the union with a G is Georgia. It's the only one. Because it goes Florida, Georgia, Hawaii, Idaho, Illinois, Indiana. Doo -doo -doo -doo. 
capital of Georgia, I believe, is Atlanta. God, it's going to be Columbus, isn't it? It's got it's Georgia. Let's just see if we can find the state house. If we can go to Atlanta, it's I meant to say it's Atlanta, not it's Georgia. If we could see a state house or something. Capital Gateway. Okay, it's got to be. Could it be Logan? It really looks like an A. It looks like West Lance. That doesn't do that sort of thing, though. It's Southeast. Southwest. West. Oh, Christ. But it's Atlanta. If this is Georgia. Which is a huge if. Man, I don't like this. This feels wrong in every possible way. Because it could be a G for the city, too. Capital city and G in 10 seconds. Um, I actually can't think of a capital city that begins with a G in the United States. I don't have those memorized alphabetically anymore, though. I used to. Ah, it's Raleigh. I have no idea what the G meant. How did you find that? We are across from the North Carolina General Assembly. I would love to know. I'm going to have to go and read the uh, read the commentary and see if Brad posted something. Because how the hell do you get that? It was Lane. Not quite Lance, but Lane. Wow. I'm impressed by that. I like my reasoning, though. I felt that was that was well justified. At least I knew it was shaky as hell. Oklahoma City tourist information. I wonder if maybe we're in Oklahoma City. I probably won't get round five. Cool. Great. <laughs> At least we've got round four for to look forward to. Okay, C. Okay, okay. Okay, C. Um, the Cox Center. Oh, shoot. Which may now be the Chesapeake Energy Arena? <laughs> uh, no idea. Let's see if we can see some street names. Try and narrow that down. We're by the Veolia Energy Building. Um, J.E. Dunn Construction. Gaylord Street. L.K. Gaylord? Bricktown says. Well, here's Bricktown. Oh, there's the convention center. It is Gaylord. So, are we on the Reno side or the Red Sheridan side? What are you? I don't know. You're connected to it, though. Um, Cox is on the south side of whatever street we're on. There's the building. Okay, yeah, there's Viola Energy. Cool. That's a fiver. Yep. Zoom into where I was. Right there with you. And by right there, I mean already did. Purple Frog featuring a 30 second chat delay since. <laughs> I was thinking about all the things that I would love Shadow Stevens to do because before I contact him, right, I want to have a whole suite of things. I'd love to have him say 5,000 points, I'd love to have him say 25,000. Like some sort of perfect score. And then it would be great if he was like the, you know, there's a new follower or welcome to the pond. Thanks for your subscription kind of thing, right? Shout out Stevens, man. How cool would that be? Round five. That's beauty. 617 is the area code. Does not help at all. Sales, rentals, commercial, and management. Remax Realty Plus. 617 is the area code. Ed Flynn for the Boston City Council. That can't be. Because um, Boston is not the capital of Massachusetts. Maybe it is. I was thinking it was Springfield, but you know what? Boston might be the capital of, city of, of Massachusetts. It seems really wide open for Boston, though. That can't be what I saw. 
508 is also your area code. 617 and 518 are your area codes. There's a stop and shop. Jack Conway Realty. No parking during a snow emergency. I mean, Boston would have snow emergencies. I don't know what the Massachusetts plate looks like. It's a two-sided uh, city state, so this is two-sided. She looks saucy as hell. Like she's late, so, or somebody is late. She's waiting for somebody to pick her up. She's like, "Now where are you? You're not here." Um, Boston Bagel Company. I think legitimately we're in Boston. I don't know if 617 is the area code for Boston. And I can't see any street names. We got the location based on the bridge. What bridge? What bridge? Oh, there's a bridge on a campaign sign. having problems again. It might be the mouse, actually. Not that one the other side. There's one on the other side? Oh, there is a campaign poster. Oh, yeah. That's a very distinct bridge. Now it makes me wonder if there are actually <laughs> bridges in Boston. Well, there have got to be because of the damn harbor, right? Bridges all over the damn place. But boy, not knowing what street we're on makes this very difficult. What would be large enough to find? Well, if that is the Boston Bagel Company, maybe. The Realtors, honestly, maybe. Or, or the Stop and Shop. It's got to be the Stop and Shop. But the problem is, Boston is freaking huge. So I'm just going to have to look and find a street that has a stop and shop and a right aid across the street from it? Come on now, that's insane and you know it. <clears throat> a T-stop would definitely help. I feel like this isn't, th these buildings aren't big enough to be in this area and I'm losing my mouse. That's, that's the problem. There's a street name somewhere. What the hell, man? Yep, it's the mouse. Something's wrong with the mouse. And I can't plug it in right now because my phone is charging on the cable. Oh, I'm out of time. It was Boston. We were on Broadway. Where was the Broadway sign? I'm just happy I found it was Boston. Since I was told I wouldn't get it, and I did. How much charge is on this thing? 26%, that'll last for a while. I need, I need, it's more important that I have a responsive mouse than a charged phone. Ah. <sighs> Well, there's your challenge. That's cool. State capital is actually not moving. 22,000. The only bad one was Georgia. Um, it's good enough for seventh, unfortunately. This Georgia is what's going to kill me. If you look at uh, look at this, Colin got two points off. Jay Smith. Wow, way to go, Jay. Nicely done. Appreciate it. Uh, it was on the challenge fence. Oh, bummer. We missed it. Hey, well, there you go. That was curated by zero three two one six five four. And uh, thank you for, so much for doing so. I really appreciated it. It was a lot of fun. You can find more challenges like that over at reddit.com slash r slash geoguesser. If you're watching on Twitch, stick around. There's plenty of geoguesser yet to come. If you're watching on YouTube, you'll have to wait until tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated to everything that happens. And until next time, cheers.